Hi everyone, my name is Christina and welcome back to another video. As you've seen by the title and the thumbnail, today's an exciting day because we are going fishing. And I got my dad a little gift a while back and we are going um, coastal here in Santa Barbara through the Santa Barbara Sports Fishing Company, I think it's called. Um, so we've got the boys, Jared and I, my dad, and then one of my dad's friends is coming. So this is going to be an exciting day. It is bright and early, earlier than what we're used to, but sit back and I hope you enjoy the video. Okay, so we have arrived at the harbor. Alex, you ready? I'm ready. Jared, you ready? I'm ready for bed. He's ready for bed. It's too early for him. <laughs> it's not 11 o'clock. <laughs> so um, the reason I'm doing this is because my dad grew up fishing and I grew up fishing with him. And um, he is an absolute, has a huge passion for fishing. So this is gonna be exciting. <laughs> he's, he's back there with his friend. Um, speaking Arabic, uh, but I'm excited. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. There's no wind. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Yeah, let's It'll see what we can catch. Okay, so we've arrived on the boat. The company's called Santa Barbara Sport Fishing Charters. Mouthful. We've got Ollie, look at him. We've got all the reels right above him. It's actually a pretty good sized boat. I thought it'd be a lot smaller. This is where they will fillet the fish for us and throw in the scraps for the seagulls. So it's actually very beautiful. I'm excited. I'll put a link uh, in the description below for the company if you're interested. Uh, Tony is the captain, so we're all very excited. <laughs> Everyone, this is my pops, Habib. <laughs> are you excited to go fishing? Of course. Of course. What do you want to catch today? We're glad to catch some rockfish, and we are happy if we are. Yeah. Like lucky, probably halibut. Halibut. He loves oh. halibut. Barracuda? No, not barracuda. White sea bass. Sea bass, yeah. See, I don't know my fish guys, he knows everything. <laughs> so we're really excited. And we're pulling off to get some bait. Life bait. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm fishing for great whites today. You're fishing for great whites? Is that cool with you? Great whites, Dad. Wanna see some great white sharks? I'm gonna fish for great whites. Like Why not? That takes Why not? The man of few yeah. words. <laughs> so we're picking up live bait right now, anchovies. That's perfect. So Captain Tony is going to give us some information right now. So this is our GPS. This is telling us where I was yesterday, these green uh, track lines. This is us right here. And this is the sonar. So what I'm doing is I'm driving over these saved waypoints. And as I get up to some of this area here, you'll notice the bottom's going to get shallower. We're in 152. As we climb up onto this here, we're getting shallower and you start to see some of the fish showing up on the screen. Now, they're just like us. Sometimes they're hungry and sometimes they're not. <laughs> so we'll move around. We'll look at different areas. We'll, get, we'll grab the hungry ones. So that looks like a good spot right there. we got a nice condensed area of fish. Yeah. Number 71. And we're looking for rockfish right now? We're looking for rockfish. Those are going to be like blue bass, vermilion reds. Cod, olives, white fish, just a big assortment of rockfish. Rockfish family, there's probably close to 20 fish in it. Oh, wow. We might catch 10 of them. Wow. How big the rockfish can be? Rockfish can be this big, it can be this big. Wow. Holy so, crap. You know, I like to keep them starting around 8 to 10 inches and then kind of bigger. We'll put together a big, nice catch. Big ones, small ones, medium ones. Awesome. We have, we have a dial rod and reel combination. We're gonna be using six ounce sinkers today. This is what's gonna bring your bait to the bottom, bring it down, okay? Above it, we call this a dropper loop. We have this special hook, it's called a circle hook, okay? okay. It's different than a J hook. A J hook is the one that you get a bite and you set. You don't wanna do that with these. These you just hold and give them resistance. Let them bite two, three seconds. 
seconds, then start reeling them in, okay? All right, so we are all getting baited up right now. And Jared, we got bets going for who can catch the first fish that stays on board. Biggest fish. Biggest fish. Most fish caught. Is that it? And smallest fish and smallest. We got four, four bets going. Let's see. Alex has a chance. Oh, Alex, you have a chance to win. All right, my dad got the first catch. Oh, that is beautiful. Holy cow. So this is a vermilion rockfish. Good job, Dad. You win. Woo! <laughs> so mine is a different type of rockfish. This is an olive rockfish or a Johnny Bass. Nice. Awesome. Good catch. Second catch. What? What? Catch up, Bolly. Let's go. <laughs> Jared catching the third fish. What'd you get? Oh, and check this out. What? It's got food in there. Shrimp. What the what heck? Is that? It's a shrimp. <laughs> oh, it was eating dinner. Breakfast. So is, this a good, is this a good fish? <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely. What is it? Johnny Bass. Same That's as the one you caught. Oh, same one that I did. We're going to put that on your hook. <laughs> okay, you guys, we have... Ollie, oh, that's such a tiny fish. Ollie's winning the uh, smallest fish award right now. Alex has a big fish. Oh. Get ready. It's a big sheephead. Okay, stop. A sheephead? Wait, what about it? A sheephead. It's beautiful. No way. Holy oh, cow! Way. What? That's hype. Uh, can I That's... come on the other side of me? Oh Drive my god. Wow. This... Look at you, Alex. Thank you. Wow, Alex, that is a beautiful fish. This is definitely a keeper. Wow. This is a male. They start off female and then they go to. <laughs> that guy's crazy. Look at the teeth on Holy that sucker. Holy cow. And Alex gets the biggest fish. So Kamal caught the smallest fish. Look at the size of that. So I caught a grouper. The real name of these is a Picaccio. What is it? Picaccio. Picaccio. Yeah. It's beautiful. It's a nice, it's a nice brown. Good eater too. Yeah. Cinnamon bass. Way over there. So though. Ollie caught a white fish. White Very fish. Very nice. California white fish. So this is the fish, the smallest fish that's been caught so far by Kamal. Really? <laughs> so he's winning that part. Pops catching a third fish. Look at that. Tying it up. Jared's got three. Alex has two. I have three. Ollie has three. Oh, you have two? No, that was no you got three. Yeah, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, teen's got something. We think it might be big. <laughs> very aggressive at first. Are you tiring it out? It's tiring me out. <laughs> Look at her. It's not bigger than mine. I don't think it is, but man, it was the first. Okay, stop. Oh yeah, it's nice. Oh, it's same, yeah. same one as Alex. What's that? It's tough. Oh yes, yes, that's its inside. It's like his um. Look at those teeth. His guts. His guts. Holy Ooh. crap! Sorry, bud. So sorry. But we're gonna eat you. <laughs> Teams, you need to get a picture of you holding that. Which one's bigger? Peppers. Yeah. Sorry, Teams yeah. caught the biggest one so far. Did you bet, uh, Alex? <laughs> I did. Yeah. All right. Give a bite. Look at that thing. Look at that. That is a beast. That is quite heavy after a while. Yeah, you reeled that in nicely. Good job, oh babe. My God. Is that the I... biggest fish you ever caught? Uh, definitely, yeah. Yeah? It's freaking awesome. Congrats. Teams got the biggest fish. So, Ollie caught fish number four? Five. Five. And what is it? Starry rockfish. See the stars on his back? Oh, that's cool. Good yeah. job, Ollie. First Thank one. You. All right, Teens caught another one. What number is this, Teens? Number seven. Number seven. She's crushing all of us. Oh, that's good. Look at her. Vermilion oh, rockfish. I like the others. What is that thing what right there? Vermilion? The guts? Vermilion or red snapper. And this is its air bladder. Oh. See that when I... That's yeah, what keeps oh. the air Controls out of its it. depth. Yep. Some of them are affected by that. That is wild. It's a pretty fish. It is. Wow. Good job, teams. Number seven? Yeah, my dad had just caught one right before and I missed it. It's right. fish number four. Nice. Here's our catch right here. We're doing well. We've got a couple big ones down there. Oh my god. Wow. Look, that's what was teams, I think. Let's see. And then Alex Another has one that's going to be better. I think this is Christine's right that's there. Christine. Oh, Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Kamal's caught.
that third one? <laughs> He's now won uh, the title for the smallest fish so far. Look at that. Oh. He regained it. He, lost he did. It, he lost it to me it. and then regained it. <laughs> wow. All right, caught another one. Ooh, fish number eight. And which one's this one? This is a vermilion rockfish, rock or red snapper. I just, wow, the inside, that whole, that uh, air pocket. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy. And a big old tongue. Oh, Catch another. Yeah. Catch oh, another know. little one. Oh my, come on. <laughs> King of the little fish. <laughs> And Jared has one. This is a grouper or the Boccaccio. <laughs> Very feisty fella. Yeah, he was serious. Look how giant air bladder is. <laughs> yep. Some of them react different. These ones are full of pressure. Holy cow. Look what Alex caught. Fish number six. It's Alex. What happened? It got tangled. No, what happened to the fish? Oh yeah, so the fish fell off my hook. And Captain... Captain Tony. Literally, Captain Tony literally caught it, it speared it before it slammed back down. That was awesome. It's like the best reflex of all time. Fish number six, let's do it. Fish number six, Olive for Jared. Wow, that one was fun. He, he was serious, dude. That's awesome. Wow. That's a big Looks like it's sticking its tongue big, out. That's about as big as they get on the coast here. They get bigger than that at the islands. That is that's a fine awesome. fish. There we go. Abid just caught another rockfish. Christina's got the drone going. It's right out there, you can see it in the shot. <laughs> this is living. Okay, so we just finished uh, fishing out there. It kind of got slow with the rockfish. So now we are, we have two rods, one on each side of the boat, and we're trolling. trolling. For game fish. For big fish. Sharks, baby. Sharks. Freshers. Yeah. Barracuda, yeah. something big and nasty. And we are actually headed uh, a little closer to shore, around 50 feet, and we're gonna drop the live fish down so we can catch some halibut. Hey, you wanna see what we got? And this is all the fish that we Our caught. Our current catch so far. Don't look live. at all of them, look at that eyeball. Pop out the socket. That's a lot of fish to fillet for Tony and a He's lot of fish for us to eat. So, we had no luck with the trolling, but we are ready to catch some halibut. I think I might have a bite. You know what? <laughs> Don't lie to the camera. <laughs> Ollie, how many fish are you at? Nine? Nine. Nine, he's in the lead. Mike, Pops and I, how many fish, Pops? I don't know, you were at eight. <laughs> eight, yeah, we're at eight. Fish. That's so, a bait fish. Do I just drop it back in? There he is, say goodbye. Number, number eight. What is that? Ronky. Ronky? Yeah, I mean, the, so I can put him in the, the real name, like, white croaker. White croaker. And now he's becoming someone's dinner. Yeah. All right, Captain Tony is also Chef Tony. Yep. <laughs> We're doing a different, this is called a head and gut. This is where we take the head off, come down the belly cavity, and remove the guts. These are usually cooked whole, fried or steamed, barbecued, grilled. Fish number 10, mackerel, also bait for the halibut. Ollie's gonna leave both of them on. For the halibut. Hopes to get a halibut. Um, Alex caught a fish, a bait fish, in. going right back in. What number is this? Uh, nine. Nine? Nine, right? Okay. Do you have a recycling I'll go with nine. <laughs> or, is it seven, or is it eight? I think it's eight. Oh, it's eight, okay. Oh, yeah. We're tied. I'm not for the halibut, so we're putting that boy back in. Sheephead. All right, sheephead, getting filleted. Nail. Yeah, you cut down behind the head, cut into the belly cavity, down to the vent. These ones have a lot of bone in them. Belly number one. Wow. Flip them over and you just do the same cut. Big rib bones in there. Right yeah, you can there. hear just cutting right through it. Okay. One of them. That's what you get left with, just the carcass. Wow. Crabs are going to feast on this today. <laughs> That's a thick piece of meat. People say that they think that these taste like lobster. Really? They eat crab and lobster. That's why they have such crazy teeth. 
Urch sea, like uni, sea urchin, crustaceans. So to catch them on an anchovy doesn't happen very often. Oh, I see. What do you usually use? Squid. Oh, okay. Yeah. Holy cow. You don't want that thing biting you. Wow. Ah! That's insane. That's crazy. Like a bone. So here's our fish fillet, two big bags for us. And then the rest are for Kamal, beheaded and not filleted. And there's the other bag. This is a 10 pound bag of fish. Is it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we just finished fishing a full, full day of it. We are heading back into the harbor area. We actually caught over 50 fish. So my dad won getting the first fish. I won getting the biggest fish. Kamal won getting the smallest fish. He's like the king of that. <laughs> Ollie, myself, and I think my dad tied for the most fish, which was 10. And then Jared had nine. And So, how was it? What do you think? Oh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, I'm really hyped I caught that fish. That was insane. I've never caught something like that exotic or weird before. And Tony said that we, the fact that we both caught two male sheephead fish, Usually it doesn't happen. Usually it's like a male with a bunch of female, a little player down there. Um, and they're fish that actually start out female and then turn into male. So now that we caught both males, he thinks one of those fish down there is gonna do that sex change and go to the male side. It's very it's really interesting, weird. very weird. He's it. like, do some research, it's crazy. what do you think? I actually thought it was awesome. I had a lot of fun. A lot of fun. It was worth waking up early. It was a beautiful so day. So peaceful. It was fun catching the fish. Yeah, awesome. It was, I would do it again. It was very magical. And I would highly and recommend it to anybody who's interested in Santa Barbara. Definitely check it out. It's yeah. awesome. Santa Barbara's for fishing charters. Yeah. Tony is amazing. See what and there's thought. plenty of room and it's it's a lot of fun. What do you think? Did you have fun? A lot of fun. A lot of fish. A lot of fish and, and a lot of fun. Are happy. Thanks for your Oh, oh, I love you. <laughs> so now we have a lot of fish to uh, to cook at home. But Ollie, quick question: What did you think of it? It was really fun. It was a lot I'd fun, do it right? again. Yeah. Yeah, it was it was awesome. So right now, actually, once we dock and we take all of our fish, um, <laughs> we are going to the Blue Water Grill. Uh, and Tony said, if you bring your own fish and you let them know that you went with Tony. Uh, they can cook it five different ways for you depending on what you want. So we're gonna head over there and try this fish out. Let's have some fish and some beer. Let's see, we're gonna have a variety. We'll see uh, Which whose fish favorite? tasted the best. There we go. <laughs> so we've arrived at Blue Water Grill. There you go, Blue Water Grill. And the fish that we caught this morning is now on our plates. <laughs> My dad was not able to join us. Um, he had to go do something with Kamal, but I chose the fish and chips with coleslaw and carrots, baby carrots. Jared got, Jared and Ollie actually got the exact same thing, grilled tacos. No, beer battered. Beer battered. So oh deep, yeah, you did deep differently. Fried, deep fried tacos. And just so you guys know, this fish is actually the fish that we caught. They actually grill it here for you in all different types of techniques. So you can have it whatever way you want. So You know I just said that. The yeah. fish that we caught this morning is now on our plate. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sure. But he, he did a good job explaining it in more details <laughs> with some uh, salsa, well, not salsa, beans, beans and chips. And chips yeah. Thanks, Ollie, and Ollie did avocado. the same thing. Isn't that crazy? Ollie did the same thing. And then Alex over here, what'd you get, Alex? That's, I got it blackened and it came with this awesome Mediterranean like olive oil sauce. Olive oil and herb sauce. Like, with french fries and freaking awesome. <laughs> So this looks really good. Let's dig in. All right, teens. Moment of truth. Let's see how it is. I wish I knew what fish this was, but she puts everything in ketchup. We gave him like four different fish yeah. to fry. So <laughs> that's probably the sheep's head. That would be my guess. Because I need a thick. Yeah. How is it? Is it good? It doesn't taste fishy. That's because it's fresh. And when fish doesn't taste fishy, that's when you know it's good. Yep. So, very, very good. All right, we're ending it with the chocolate lava cake with vanilla ice cream and raspberry sauce on top. Looks delicious. Alex is <laughs> eagerly waiting to eat it. Hurry up with the spelling. <laughs> Can you believe we caught that today? And that's, yeah, that's what we caught. Doesn't look so beautiful. 
see how it is, teens. Looks like vanilla bean ice cream. Oh, oh hot. Yeah, it's hot. The way to my heart. Chocolate lava cake on top of brownie with ice cream. Way to my heart. And cats. And cats. All right, so that's gonna conclude the video, guys. We had so much fun. I'm so happy I got to do this for my dad. I think he had a blast. We caught over 50 fish. We ate our fish. It was uh, very, very well done. Done. Um, Santa Barbara Sports oh. Fishing Charters. Tony, highly recommend if you want to come down and do that. He can do half days, full days. You can go out to the islands if you want to go even farther. But I prefer the coastal, uh, and it was amazing. It was awesome. Everyone had fun, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah right, Alex? Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> so um, that's going to be it. I'll link all his information in the description below if you do want to check him out. Blue Water Grill, great if you want to bring your fish and they do it for you, which is awesome. You don't have to try and do it yourself. And that's going to be it. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.